Okay, so this is a young lady with uh, apparently a lesion on ultrasound in her pancreas, but that wasn't seen on CT. Madame, let's just look at the this. So there's her liver, portal vein, bile duct, all here, okay? So it's always the same thing in everybody. Portal vein, get a nice view of the head here, all the way down to the papilla. There's her pancreatic duct as well. You can see the ventral dorsal distinction here. Darker ventral, lighter dorsal. Uh, and there's a little cyst that they saw on the ultrasound. So they, they didn't see this on the CT, but they saw it on the ultrasound. That's pretty good. Okay, so it's probably a small side branch IPMN. And then out to the tail. Oh, and there's something else here, though. Look at this. Wow. So they saw this on the ultrasound, but not on the CT. Interesting. This looks like an neuroendocrine tumor. Okay. Kind of like an insulinoma, actually. Out to the tail. Okay, so I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna have to biopsy that. I think I. I don't know. I mean, I. I, I think. What other one? No, it's all one lesion here. I kind of don't want to biopsy this. You know, I think it. it it's so clearly a solid lesion. They haven't done the biochem, chem, chemical markers. I think, I, again, I'll have her seen by the surgeon, and they may just be based on the, you know, if the CT shows, I think, it, I think they need to redo the CT, if you ask me. And if the CT, if this lights up on CT, and on top of that they get some type of biochemical evidence of uh, hypersecretion of something, she can go straight to surgery. And then for the unseen, that little cyst there, that, I think that's not a problem for now. Restez sur le côté, s'il vous plaît. Voilà. So I think you just have to be very, uh, certainly we're uh, a little more conservative with biopsy now because there is a risk of tumor seeding. There's the lesion clearly seen there. I could put the Doppler on from the front of it just to see if it's uh, hypervascular. I know there's people that would start pulling out the contrast now and doing all kinds of... Uh, Special studies and stuff. Uh, I just don't see the point. I, I think that, uh, is that hypervascular? You know, elastography here I don't think is of much value. This is clearly a solid lesion. So while you're here, if you see uh, what looks like a neuroendocrine tumor, you know, take a quick look at the gastric folds to see if she has thickened folds. She doesn't. And I prefer to do it on the ultrasound. I think it's the mo more accurate than actually the endoscopy. I want to take a quick look at her liver and see if she has any what looks like metastatic lesions. Because if they didn't see this on the CT, what else did they miss in the liver? OK, this looks pretty good, though. And I think I'm just going to give her a break. She's kind of a little uncomfortable. So I think this is clearly a neuroendocrine lesion with a small cystic lesion in the uncinate. So surgery, see what they think, and FNA really only if it's going to change management.